So question nine asks, in the quadrilateral PQRS below, sides PS and QR are parallel for what value of X? So let's kind of draw out exactly what they're asking here. They're saying this uh, side PS, so this side PS, uh, and that's the line segment between letters P and S. And they're saying uh, QR as well. So what, what's QR? Well, QR is this line segment between Q and R. And then they're asking about uh, some angle X, and that's this angle right here. So there's a couple tricks that will help understand this problem. One is to imagine that if you have parallel lines, one of the implications of that is that if I slide a parallel line, so let's imagine I slide QR over in this direction. If I were to slide it over that way, it would exactly line up over PS. That's one of the definitions of a parallel line. So we can imagine that these lines are actually almost on top of each other. They're almost the same. Now we can also imagine that we extended the top of our shape. So let's take the top line, just extend it out. And now if we think about this, our line shifted over and extending off the top line of our shape, then X here, this angle, is actually the exact same as this angle right here. And this is really good because we actually know what the whole angle is here. So this whole angle is 180 degrees, that's a line, and we know the 180 degrees, we know that there's this other segment which we said was equal to 70 degrees. So right here, this is 70. So if we take 180 minus 70 degrees, we're going to have X, and in this case, this is equal to 180 minus 70 is 110 degrees, answer D.